Coming up next, it's a UFC heavyweight division collision. Well, the crowd pops as this guy makes the walk to the octagon, and you can see why if you've watched film on him. This is a true mixed martial artist, plus skills in all areas, and figures to be a handful, really, for anybody in this division. Probably comfortable tonight anywhere the fight goes. Truly a well-rounded MMA fighter. You know, we, we, we trot that term out there a lot. This guy fits the bill. This guy is a very well-rounded fighter. He can do it all. If the fight takes place standing or on the ground, he's gonna be comfortable in all areas of the game. So here's the combat sambo master, the Dagestan native Khabib Nurmagomedov. It's really been remarkable what he's been able to accomplish in the UFC. Came in with some hype and largely Joe has lived up to it every step of the way, working his way towards an eventual UFC lightweight championship fight. Most people believe on any given Saturday night, we are staring at the most dominant 155 pound fighter in the world. This guy is a ground and pound expert. Look for him to try to get this fight to the ground where he can land thunderous blows from the top position. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. So more than 15 years, the gap in age between these two fighters with the same height and a similar reach. All right, now for the particulars, here's Bruce Buck. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 265 pounds. Fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada, USA, the Gambler. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a grappler, holding a professional record of 27 wins, no losses. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of the Republic of Dagestan, Russia, Habib the Eagle, Imago Medal! All right, commit the rules in the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. I want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, go back to your corners, come out fighting. All right, here we go. I am fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming, and they're finally going to get after it. You ready? You ready? All right, so this UFC Grand Prix tournament is coming up next. This format has been all the rage with a lot of the hardcore mixed martial arts fans out there. Sort of an homage to the history of UFC and Pride with a single night tournament game event here. And let's see who can be the last man standing here tonight. Good punch. Excellent movement on the ground here. Constantly moving, constantly staying busy. Oh, hammer fist here by Nurmagomedov. He moves into half guard. Oh, he lands a elbow. huge elbow to the head. Excellent movement here on the ground. He's got a half guard here. Joe doing a nice job here, staying busy from the bottom. Excellent movement on the ground here. Always trying to better his position. He's gonna try to take the back, I think. All right, hammer fist here by Nurmagomedov. 
He's looking for the Kimura. He's got his arm pinned down. Got a very good Kimura. That is just an amazing technique. Oh and my God! He'll do it. Great job. Didn't waste any time. Took this fight to the ground and got the early submission. Yeah, Joe, we could barely get the fight clock sponsor out, and the submission comes here in round one. He said he didn't want to waste a lot of time. He knew his opponent would know what was coming. It was going to be takedown attempts in bunches, but he couldn't stop the early shot, and, and he certainly couldn't stop the submission. So great effort and even better technique here tonight. And here we can see it again. Beautiful technique here on this Kimura. Perfectly applied for the tap. And here we see it again. Beautiful submission victory. So there he is, your winner by submission, and that's exactly how you put the rest of this division on notice. Looks like this guy could be a factor moving forward in this division. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliata has called a stop to this contest at one minute, 20 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by tap out. Well, it's becoming a pretty common visual inside that octagon as Khabib Nurmagomedov gets his hand raised yet again here tonight. And when the injuries and the weight cutting issues aren't part of the narrative and we just focus on the combat and this guy's skills, he looks the part of the best lightweight in the world. A lot of people believe that eventually you are looking at a UFC lightweight champion, if not UFC Hall of Fame.